Firefox is Max from nexushacks.com. So I was able to get um, 4G tethering working. Um, basically, you need to um, install Wi Fi tether. And uh, it's working. And uh, I show you that it's connected to uh, Nexus S 4G. As you can see there. That that means ad hoc. I had a uh, ad hoc enabled on my. Um, you need to hack your tab 10.1 to make that work. Uh, let's look at business. And I got 4G working, except I don't get 4G signals here in my basement. So I'm gonna go put my phone outside real quick, and we'll do a speed test to prove you to that it works. Interestingly, I've got it connected on ad hoc mode. I guess it you can actually connect to. Devices. You can see Nexus S 4G there, and I've got internet working on both my Tab 10.1 and this one. So even if it's, if it's ad hoc, um, you can actually connect multiple devices. So I'll do a speed test here for you on my computer. I don't know why that is, but it, you can actually connect multiple devices. I think it's because um, you can actually connect multiple devices. It's, it's not... Um, designate it to one thing. But I'm getting 4G signals, I put it outside and let's see if we get anything above like 2-3 megabits per second it should that should mean uh, pretty good. Well, well not too bad it's you know you still can do uh, 4G um, that's because probably my 4G speed is a little bit slow and my phone's outside, so it's kind of. But uh, let's try it on my my uh, tab 10.1 real quick. The same test. So um, to do this on your Nexus S 4G, you'll need a rooted uh, Nexus S 4G, and I recommend a, a aftermarket ROM. I'm running the Matrix ROM. Um, you should be able to do it using CM7 mod uh, ROM. Just don't use. I don't know. Uh, I don't think it works with the stock ROM because it has a security feature. But um, you can also use a native uh, Wi-Fi tether, but 4G won't work. Um, so basically, you just need to download Android Wi-Fi tether, which is free. Just Google it, and you can download the APK file and install it. Um, and, and make sure you check on unknown sources for installations. Um, so I'll be back when this installs. It's kind of slow. Maybe I dropped off for you. Let me go check. So I did a speed test outside. It seems like um, Sprint is having some kind of network problems, but I am on 4G. Um, so it's not going to be a great test since uh, my 4G itself is slow. I think it's even slower than 3G. Um, sometimes it happens, not all the time. Uh, but I'll test it again. I'm not even getting like one megabits per second download for some reason. Oh, not for some reason, but because it's it's slow. Yeah, that's exactly what I was getting on my phone out there. Anyway, you can um, get uh, free Wi-Fi tethering using your 4G. As I just found out, um, the best way to test it is uh, make sure you have a ad hoc device. Um, it seems to work better on my Tab 10.1. Um, well, but my computer is connected to it too. So you can get um, Wi-Fi tether, ad hoc mode, and you can actually connect multiple devices. I don't know why, but you can. So see y'all later. Uh, enjoy your 4G tethering.